Worldless is a beautiful and haunting minimalistic 2D platforming game with turn-based combat. I'm actually not quite sure how that works, but let's dive in and figure it out. Let's do it. <laughs> So right. yes, this is the Worldless demo, uh, so we get basically just a taste of the game. Mm -hmm. The first thing that's super striking is the art style. I love the the way that the world looks in here. You kind of get an idea of what the map is. It's a constellation. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I, I feel like it plays really well onto all that. So you get these nice little like animations that pop up as you walk oh. around, so like you know where you've been. Pick up these little, uh, little rectangles and give you more HP. Now, important question, do you have double jump? Uh, I do not, not yet. Oh, so that, you can get it. That, that's one of the cool things about this awesome. game is essentially you um, you go into combat with all these different mm -hmm. uh, enemies, like this one, um, and it shows you oh, nice. you have a time limit per okay. turn. Uh, you have magic attacks, you have physical attacks, and so depending on what you use, you get sort of different weaknesses for enemies and stuff. This okay. is just the sort of base entry yeah. one. Um, so it's just weak against everything. But then when it becomes the enemy's turn, you have to block against attack. Oh, that's cool. And depending on the timing, you can actually get like a perfect block where it doesn't um, deplete your shield at all. I, so I don't like turn-based games because I feel like there's not much interactivity with it, mm -hmm. but I love stuff like this where you have to actively block or deflect, and that makes me feel a little bit happier about playing this game. Yeah. Because it's like, I love that because it actually engages you. Mm -hmm. So I, I love that this game does that. Yeah, you have to sort of like switch up your strategy depending on who you're facing and stuff. There's also like some interactivity with the platforming here. So you'll see these little like dots that pop up. Oh. You press Y to sort of like activate those uh, platforms. Ooh. You can always bring up the map? city map. Yeah. Wait, that's so cool. Yeah, so it kind of just like pops out of your head and you can <laughs> always check in if you're not sure where you need to go. Yeah. Yeah, these are these little platforms that I was talking about. You kind of just like have to time your jumps right and then you can sort of absorb them and give you a nice little platform to jump off of. I just realized that there's no HUD here, which is actually, I was because I was like, wait, I'm so immersed in this, and it looks beautiful, and the combat looks so smooth. And when you brought up the map, I was like, wait, there's no HUD. Mm -hmm. This is great. Yeah, it's awesome. So this is another big part of the game. You actually can absorb the powers of your enemies. Oh. Um, so depending on what is on the bottom right corner here, it'll show us, like, essentially what uh, fills up our, our meter more. Mm. And then once we fill up the meter fully, uh, we can absorb the power. So right now it's a, a okay. fist, so physical attacks will be the one to cool. sort of fill up that bar and give us a little bit more uh, damage and capability to absorb their powers. So as you can see, it's going up at times 200%. That's pretty good. <laughs> Once we get to that bar, we'll be able to hit our bumpers and be able to absorb their powers. Here we go. So absorb powers, and then it gives you essentially a combination of different inputs to, to oh, hit. Oh, nice. Okay. So let's go ahead and do that. Does this really cool animation? Oh, okay. Y Y X. Oh, you have X, to. Boom. Do you have to guess it because it's a question mark. So depending on how full the the meter is, oh. it'll give you more of the. Of oh, the, that's so cool. Yeah. So make it kind of awesome. like. That's awesome. If you're if you're really good at sort of figuring out those on the fly, it, yeah. it's cool to kind of just like oh. spam it and try to figure out what it is. Um, you can also do like educated guesses. Yeah. Um, and then as you level up, you get these little skill trees that you can that's sort awesome. of. That's uh, awesome. Unlock as you go through the game. Yeah. Obviously, this is the demo again, so it's mm -hmm. uh, we're not going to get the full idea of everything, but yeah. But shout out to Studio No Name, and they're actually based out of Barcelona. Yeah, and shout out. They made this, and it looks absolutely gorgeous. I mean, ooh, what, ooh. I think this is, is our that an enemy, or is that? Our oh, well, they're gone. <laughs> oh no, we fall. Oh no, a scripted fall. What are we gonna do? <laughs> But yeah, I think this this area especially is one of the Whoa. coolest designs. Yeah, you can sort of check out the the full map here. Oh, God, um, so you can so you can check it on the fly if you just yeah. hit the the right thumbstick, or okay. you can go into it and actually check That's out the. So entire cool! Map. I love the transitions from gameplay to showing maps like this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, especially because it's like it's all in the the characters like yeah. head. <laughs> Are we supposed to be going further down? I think so. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so. I believe oh. right here is what where we'll get. Uh, yeah, there we go. Our first big power up. Uh, so, yeah, we absorb this uh, innocent bystander's power, and now we have a dash. <laughs> oh, cool! And the cool thing is, you can do it in. Oh my God! No uh, way! Yeah, three directions. So you can okay. go up, you can go left, you can go right. So it gives you a little bit more creativity cool. in the way that you can sort of handle these platforming challenges. I also love that if you hit Y, you just kind of like. Can make these little like bloom effects happen. Aww. This looks so pretty. Yeah, this world, it, it definitely feels very spacey, especially with the way that you kind of float when you jump, even just normally. Yeah. 
I really like that. Yeah, it feels very floaty, which is mm -hmm. nice. I always like that in platformers, like, kind of gives you a little bit more leeway to, to reach the hard to reach areas <laughs> and platforms and all that good stuff. Yeah, I also, you know, I'm impressed that there's so much fluidity in something that is so minimalistic, right? Mm -hmm. Like you're used to playing a 2D platformer with like a little bit more of a sprite for the main character, but like it still works. Yeah, absolutely. And then here we just got a orange power up. So this sort of lets us go towards some that we don't unlock just by combat. You actually have to find these in the oh. world, I believe. For example, this one lets us charge up the sword to knock up enemies, which is pretty nice. cool. This one also gives us a, I believe this one gives you a parry on perfect block. Ooh, that looks so, yeah. cool. That looks okay. Really cool. I'm gonna go for this one. Yeah. Because yeah, let's 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 try like to look that. as cool as possible for this let's play. Okay, yeah. So you gotta get the perfect parries though. Um, I'm We're gonna watching try. you. We're judging <laughs> you. <laughs> uh, yeah, please do not judge my timing, because. Uh, I'll try, I'll try my best. Oh, I missed one. <laughs> Believe me. I, I don't need it, but yeah. I'll... I mean, it's, yeah. It would it would mess with me for the entire rest You're of the You're really showing off your perfectionism <laughs> here, dude. <laughs> perfect parries, perfect platforms. We got it all. So here's another one of those rectangles. Oh, let me grab it. There we go. So now we have three. Once we get to the fourth one, oh. it'll actually fill up our HP bar a little bit more. Oh, nice. Okay. And there's some like these guys. Oh, there we go. Boom. So cool. Boom. It just, it feels so nice. Like It looks really fluid. Like I can't get over just how good it looks. Mm -hmm. So you can see in the bottom right corner, this enemy is weak to those ice attacks, which we can do by pressing Ooh, B. Okay, yeah. And then that'll be a magic attack. You can sort of tell which attacks your enemy's doing based on which direction that little flash of light comes from. So right now it's okay. vertical, so it's gonna be a magic attack. Lock it. Nice. Uh, and then they're weak to ice. Oh, I got to do both. Let's go. Oh, you filled up the bar. Look at it. It's nice. Oh, that was. Oh, it broke. Oh, my... no. Every time your guard breaks, your shield resistance will be weakened. Oh, no. Okay, okay. Okay, but the cool thing is now I can fill up the bar. We're almost to 100%. Yeah. And now we can absorb their power. And it should be. Oh, it does. Yeah, yeah you're right. It just shows everything. Awful. That's so cool. It makes it way easier for us to absorb it. Nice. So after you defeat enemies and absorb their powers, can you fight them again? Uh, so I, I'm not sure about the ones that you've absorbed their powers. There are some enemies that you can uh, re-encounter again, but if cool. you'll see a little, um, like basically a little like orange uh, uh, yeah. diamond shape. Oh, that's, press, okay. You can press Y and that'll re-engage that combat. Cool, I like that. So now we can back trace our steps this way. And we should be able to unlock some new areas now that we have our handy dandy dash. Where did our little nemesis go? Let's check it out. <laughs> so right now we are, actually I'll go further in. So right now we are on the, where that blue arrow is pinging. And right. we're trying to get to where that diamond shaped orange is. That's so cool. Okay. We're keep going a little bit further left and then we'll, we'll hit a hard right. Just keeping tabs on them. Oh look, look, it's like, <laughs> The lights in the back are signifying us oh, and the yeah. enemy. Wait, that's so cool. That's that's really cool. Oh like they're God. fighting too. Woo. I love environmental storytelling and I didn't expect to, to I didn't expect to see it in this game. Here we go. Nice. HP bar power up. Let's go. Well, that's a pretty big one. Yeah. So it, it really incentivizes you to sort of like find those little puzzles and try yeah. to find the you know, all the, the different ways that you can sort of buff your character and make your, so cool. make yourself stronger. <laughs> Yeah, it's like collecting the shards in like a Souls game and exactly. then like upgrading. That's awesome. And then, ooh, what's that? This one looks cool. Let's check it out. Oh, oh okay. That one. okay. <laughs> horizontal, vertical, vertical, horizontal. Whoa! Oh, oh, oh. I did not do that well at all. Ooh. So this one, I guess it hits you with a bunch of different attacks and you have to memorize the Oh, the okay. Um, do we and if you try fail it, it, then it goes. And you just take a bunch of damage. Do it again. Yeah, do it again. Let's okay. see if you get the perfect parry. I want, I want to see it. Okay, yeah, yeah, gamer pose. Come on. <laughs> uh, oh, you got the first yeah. one. Yeah. I think, I think I can actually figure this out. Okay, okay, cool. Here. No, I'm totally down. I believe in you. Did not do <laughs> They're oh so God. fast. Yeah, it like, I, and I think it gets progressively faster. Yeah. In one. Oh, 
<laughs> okay, let's uh, let's move on. Okay. Let's move on. Okay. <laughs> that one. Okay, maybe t taking on a challenge boss was not the right way to I mean, practice. Yeah, it's, <laughs> no, it's, a, it's a demo. We're we're, we're right. still just yeah. learning. Do we try it one more time? Nah, it's fine. Let's move on. Okay, so now we're trying to get back to where we got thrown into this abyss. Yes. So okay. We are cool. Almost back to the top. Oh. Man, we made all that progress at the top, and then they threw us down. Oh. Here's another rectangle. Boom. Nice. Oh, and now we got to do six of them. Give us a little bit of a challenge. Oh. Oh. Thank God you got that platform. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> a little scary there. Oh, this looks like a nice little open arena. I'm just always anticipating something happening in like wide areas. I'm just like, hmm. Yeah. There's gonna be a big fight here. What's up here? What's up? Ooh. I love the way that the lighting effects sort of adjust depending on where you oh. are too. Can I observe this? I cannot. That looks cool though. Hmm, okay. I wonder if that's something that we can do uh, in the full game. Whoa, Ooh. what did you just do? Uh, oh, I think I, we just unlocked a new area to go to. Oh, cool. Oh, and now you have to collect even more shards to upgrade your health. That's cool. Let's see. There's so much to discover in this game. Yeah. <laughs> I want to find some more enemies. Oh, no! Oh! Okay, so there's not, there's no fall damage, There's though. no fall damage. Thank uh, God. Okay, I, great. <laughs> I, I would have a very hard time if there was fall damage. Yeah, you know, I feel like in a platformer especially, it'd be a little bit punishing, but I mean... Also, if that's part of the gameplay loop, totally understand. Part of the challenge. You know? Yeah, because we do have that dash. So. Yeah. <laughs> and I just love the the effects, like the particles that pop up as you're dashing through. Like you see, there's like a little like circle, like trail that follows you as you as you go through it. Ooh, there's another. Another guy here. Yeah. What's this? Ooh, that's cool. Wait, what? Let's, let's see what, what we got. Do? Oh, that's so cool that you Oh, you get a bow. Whoa, yeah, absolutely. I, I will definitely take that. That is and so I'm cool. I'm going to upgrade it since I already have a point there. Oh, these power-ups look so cool. I'm very excited. Try it out. Let's find an enemy to... Also, there's like, there's that fighting happening in the background too, and I think it's showing you how to defeat uh, the guy that you're chasing after because Ooh. it showed like the snow, the ice icon. Uh huh. So I think that's really interesting. I don't know. I mean... I could just be talking on my butt <laughs> about theories. We're just speculating. But like, what if what if that's like telling you how you can defeat like certain enemies or your main guy? That's really cool. Yeah. Whoa, wow. that looks so cool. I, I what? really like that charge power up attack. That's really nice. Cool. All right, let's do it again. Boom, bam, bam. Yeah, yeah, bam. yeah, yeah, yeah. Magic. Oh, magic attack. Okay, that was like a. Fuck it. Was that a perfect parry? I, a perfect I, I thought so. Yeah, it looks like it. Boom. Bam. Nice. Ah, ah. <laughs> uh, oh, now oh, it's, it's, it's shielding now. So we oh. have to get through those little Aww. Uh, those little barriers to Nice. See uh oh what? there we go. Nice. Oh my god, look at how look at how it exploded into all those different colors it's too. So it's so pretty. Oh, and we got another skill here. <laughs> oh, more health. All right. Nice. Love it. Okay, Alan, I know we just got our new health upgrade, but I have to stop you right there. Oh, I know, we ran out of time. More. I'm sorry. We can play off screen. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's do that. Okay, great. <laughs> <laughs> if you're curious about this, you can also play the demo, but that was our playthrough of Worldless. Stay tuned for more ID at Xbox after this. This broadcast is brought to you by the Xfinity 10G Network. Get a game-changing connection today for a faster, more reliable tomorrow. The future starts now.